Doesn't look steep on film. I feel like I need to shorten my trekking poles. <sighs> Where the hell is Kyle? Dental Woods Walk. That's what he told me, folks. It's not the uphill that gets me. It's the fact that, well, this gentle ridge walk, we have to go back up that mofo. <sighs> Catskills. Uphill both ways. I'm, I'm shot. Big pack, bad idea. Cathedral Glen Trail. We're doing a little bit of uh, recon for a future snowshoe route to um, Balsam. So we're going to start over here and see if we find our way up. Let's see. How many minutes are we in? I'm lost. I can still see the truck. <laughs> but we are lost. Go left up to the railroad tracks. At railroad tracks, go left and walk to your feet down the tracks. Then take a right for a one reservoir. Oh, there's a, a clue? Oh, all right. Well, there's a reservoir, a railroad track, and apparently a sign that says trail. The blue markers or blue markings on the trees when we're going up the ski slope, they said don't don't follow them because they'll take you off and they'll get you lost. Okay. It's close for skiing. This is a ski slope apparently. Air confused. So this is the ski st well, all the skiers in the house. We hate you. Duke, is this the top? Nope. Again. We're almost there. Hey, you know what? We say something about a fall summit. We just uh, crested thinking we're at the summit. Turns out we are not at the summit. And we're not even uh, halfway up this giant top. Your calves are telling you yes, but your body's saying no. My body, my body's telling me. <laughs> so you're saying the video never shows steepness or the incline. <laughs> that is steep. Doesn't look steep on film. Remember on that last uh, bump up and we said that's the top? Was that the top? No, John. Not the top. <laughs> Are you saying there's more uphill? <laughs> when you get a chance to turn around, it's not bad. Because you get this. I can't do that. <laughs> We're done. We're going to do that slowly. Holy crap. Remember when we just said there was the end? Well, it turns out. Holy cow. That is straight up forever. We thought we had to keep going up this radical uh, cutout, but apparently we're making a left here. There's a clue. And the clue says trail. Two hours, eight minutes. But basically... Very easy terrain, almost flat to get here. Some sort of abandoned structure of yesteryear. Arm will tell me I'm turning. You know, cats go uphill. Both ways. Gentle wood walk with not a lot of up and down. Bombing down for 15 minutes. <laughs> Crack. We're enjoying some frozen stroopwafels. We have 1.4 miles. So we got to get up on top of that. So while it looks pretty close, apparently it's 1.4 miles away. Great. Can't wait. Down that. And now we got to go back up. 
this mofo, which I don't know if you can even see. It's pretty steep. But it looked flat, I felt. No, oh, straight up. Up the middle. No. I'll do it all at once. Yeah. Your heart it's going to be the last one before the next one, before the next one, before the next one. It's bullshit. Get a beautiful view off to this side. I guess that would be east ish. Summit. Yeah. All right, so we're going down. But no, come over here and look at the down. Stand over here. All right. So you stash and curl up like an armadillo and roll that way real fast. I mean, that's fast way down. I I mean, you'll you'll definitely get down quicker than I will. I should probably focus on keeping myself upright. Yeah, that, that's, uh, that's still steep. The temperature is in the mid 30s. Not bad. Um, but we're sweaty. And then when the wind hits us, it, it lets you know that apparently 30s is cold. But we can't put layers on yet because up there way to go down and now we're going back up are you making stuff up at this point I'm delirious. oh so we're at a crossroads here and we're we're looking about the way we came was to the left but that was super steep Files that way, or 2.8 miles that way. We've elected to go back the way we came up, which might have been a mistake, might not be. No matter what, it's going to be. <laughs> but this walking on this heavy leaf litter, you don't really know what you're stepping on. Trail is apparently the highest difficulty. In the so. Are you saying that we've, we're both going to do the K12? On one ski? On one ski! So if you come up Cathedral Glen and you'll get to the um, Super Chief slash Discovery Lodge and you'll see there's blue blazes across the way. Maybe you can't see it, but there's an actual road over there and it definitely has blue blazes. You actually want to go up this blue blaze path, which is straight up. I don't know why there's blue blazes in both directions. Um, I, I, don't, I don't know. I, maybe the trail changes names, but when you're coming up at this super chief Discovery Lodge sign, you want to go up the hill. All right, we have hit the bulk of the crazy grade. Now we're heading on to Cathedral Glen. The ski area is closed, folks. The this most OA gate. sail. What? The OA sail. Seven hours later, and we could see the reservoir again. It's a welcome sign, because we know from the reservoir, we're gonna hang a left on the railroad tracks, and uh, we're gonna make it up before it gets dark. Make the noise the hamstrings make. Oh, oh, oh. Why'd you say that? <laughs> you to be functioning. <laughs> this is literally what happened to Rip Van Winkle. This hike was described as a gentle ridge walk. He left out the fact that it'd be more than one mountain. 
and also that it would be like seven and a half hours, but uh, whatever, I'm alive. Say the word gentle ridge walk one more time. 